Hey ya, it's Whimsy and we're back today with a new episode of Mass Effect 2. Today we are going to do the Thane loyalty mission, I'm thinking. I'm very excited to go back to the Citadel. I think I have a lot of credits right now, I guess I still do. Uh, we did the Lair of the Shadow Broker last episode, which is a DLC with Liara. And honestly, I liked it so much. It was a lot of fun. We learned about a new species called the Yag, I think, if I remember correctly. And we still have a lot of information to read about our crewmates. And um, I'm very excited about that. So we'll start with that today. And then we'll go back to, um, to the Citadel with Thane. So yeah, let's jump into it. Let's go. All right, here we are. So yeah, like I said, I think it's here. Yeah, we still have a lot of things that I want to read. We read uh, Miranda and Garrus last time, uh, but we have a lot of intel on our crewmates. Uh, for Morden, professor previously attached to certain special task group, impressive credentials, modifications to genophage, reestablished 99.9% .9 death rate among Krogan births. Um, current work with Shepard, obvious atonement attempt. Interesting. STG mission rep uh, report. Turian patrol ship indomitable, contacted by assisting distraction team. That was on Tuchanka, okay. Project Firebreak. Indomitable breaks position in Krogan DMZ to render assistance. STG vessel V shock 16 enters to gap in. Sensor coverage. Touchdown and landing. Commander Kire performs final review of drop parameters. Mission specialist Solus suggests change to plan. When informed that plan will not be changing unless parameters shift, specialist Solus suggests Commander Kire has foreign obstruction in Cloaca. I don't know if I'm pronouncing any of this right. I'm so sorry if I'm not. Operative Rentola detects incoming Warlock scouts. Scouts neutralized. Rentola treated for minor injuries. After assisting, Specialist Solus asks if failure to land undetected constitutes parameter shift. Commander Curie uh, suggests operation may proceed as planned. Specialist Solus suggests cloacal obstruction is in fact Curie's cranium. Wait, what? Team leaves V Shock 16, proceeds towards primary drop point Warlock Agri Center. Warlock Agri Center reach. Team splits with distraction team lead by operative Rentola, drawing Warlock scouts from area. Primary team disables Solar Array. Warlock workers leave Agri Center to repair Solar Array. Primary team enters Agri Center. Mission Species Solus performs water and soil tests to ensure proper payload dispersal, assisted by Species Melon. Distraction team breaks radio silence, informs primary team that Warlock group returning. Species Solus asks whether this constitutes parameter shift. Commander Curie suggests that Species Solus is in fact a walking cloaca, or states importance of holding the line. <laughs> Wait, let me read that again. <laughs> what is a cloa cloaca? Cloaca? I, don't, I have no idea. Are they like bantering? I guess they are. This is so funny. The importance of holding the line, y'all, obviously. Warlock team arrives at Agri Center and initiates close quarters combat. Operative Jiren and Coral killed. Species Melon and operatives uh, Ishao and Shinok seriously injured. Warlock team killed in entirety. Last team prevented from broadcasting alarm due to specialist Solus stabbing Warlock guard to eye with pitchfork. Sustaining injuries to face and right corneal horn, horn in process. Oh, that's how. That's how he got his uh, his horn. Uh, oh, and the scars. Distraction team arrives to provide relief. Commander Kure not notes parameter shift. Suggests Rintola take injured team member back to the ship while he and remainder of team attempt to hit secondary top point. 
Despite injuries to face and head, Species Solis refuses to return to ship, noting need for soil and water analysis at secondary site. Curious Species Solis is one tough cloak. <laughs> Specialist Melon greatly distressed by discovery that Agri Center was staffed by female Krogan, including guards killed in attack. Species Solis calms colleague and provides sedative. Species Melon returns to ship with other injured team members. Damn. Active team finishes disposal of bodies and heads for a secondary job point, Warlock Hospital. Active team infiltrates hospital undetected. Specialist Solis. Determines chemical makeup of soil and water fall within necessary parameters. Payload dispersed into water and food. Active team returns to ship. Spacious Solis declines treatment, insists on providing additional care for Hishao, Shinok, and Melon. Spacious Melon makes formal protests, suggesting actions against female Krogan violate mission parameters of maintaining pro population levels without negatively impacting culture. Species Solus requests pro protests be stricken from record due to Melon's injured condition. Commander Kiri concurs. Melon given additional sed sedatives, unconscious for remainder of operation. Operation. Protest stricken from submitted copy of report. STG vessel V shock 16 lift off, departing through existing sensor gap mission complete. Yeah, Melon was really not feeling it. He was the assistant, right, that we saw in um, in Tuchanka, like the the mission with uh, with Morden. Um, yeah, he and he was kind of right. I mean, yeah, it's complicated. Bibliography, published works, first writer only. Treatment modalities utilizing redundant nervous system, dispersal vectors in compromised ecosystem, genetic consequence, resequencing methods to prevent tissue cloning, cross species contamination and xenoplague potential, mm -hmm. testing modalities for varin and pyjax, disease in population stability, indoctrination progression and mental degradation, classified STG. That's uh, with the Reapers. Biological vectors and social effects, classified as TG. Second stage viral manipulation and modification. Threat potential analysis, Turian. Threat potential analysis, human. Threat potential analysis, sorry, threat potential analysis, Baterian. Production credits, the pirates of Penzance. Interspecies community theater, as Major General Stanley. Yolanti. Interspecies Community Theater as Lord Chancellor Hamlet, Interspecies Edition. Oh my goodness, as Polonius. Science Fun Today as himself, guest. Science Roundtable Rights of the Patient as himself, guest. The Facts of Fate as himself, guest. Oh, that's amazing. That's so good. The singing. Surveillance Transcript. Patient. I can't, I can't. Unintelligible. Dr. Morden Solis. Call. Dr. Daniel Abrams. Damn it. MS. More than solid. Time of death, 2217. Need to remove body, sanitize area, not that sanitation matters, same plague, still no need to risk further infection. Uh, Daniel, how can you, should we do something for him? More than, why? Baterian belief in afterlife involves soul leaving body through eyes. Treatment of corpse unimportant by cultural standards. Unless eyes removed by enemies. <laughs> Very insulting. <laughs> but we just lost another patient. Yes, more patients than time. Plus, impossible to save everyone. Go crazy if you try. So save who you can, move on. Save more if we hurry. Hurry. We shouldn't be here waiting for people to come to us. We should be out there getting medicine to them. I can go. No, pointless. Already more than enough patients here. Can't risk combat with Vorcha or gangs. Better to save those who make effort to come to us. Doctor, there are blue suns outside. They're, they're asking for all humans to come out. That's the assistant. Of course, expected as much. We're losing to Vorcha. Need to establish dominance. We'll speak with them. Daniel, remove corpse. Uh, go uh, get next patient. Still more to save. Sound of footsteps. Solus leaves. He's not going to turn us over to them easy. Daniel, I don't think so. Listen, when he gets back, tell him I took some of the cure. I'm going to go out and help. But just tell him. You can't... My god, son of Godfire, what's going on? Get up, danger has passed. Blue Suns didn't expect resistance, foolish of them. Won't make dumb mistakes again. 
No chance to, I suppose. Please, up. Uh, need you to bring in next patient. Wait. Medical supplies missing. Corpse not removed. Where is Daniel? He said, went into slums trying to help those sick to come in. Yes. His decision. Hope he lives. Can't help him now. Too busy. Bring next patient. I love him. I love Morden. His... His mind... Just straight to the fact. I... Yeah. I just really appreciate him. Jacob! Ex-Alliance soldier, biotech training. Despite solid service history, clearly based on Shepard's team primarily for stabilizing elements of personality. Interesting. Workout routine, oh boy. Most recent workout stats, crunches 300, side crunches 250 per side. Squat thrust 300, leg lift 250, leg lifts weighted 125, half set up 600. Good lord. Most popular workout entertainment. Blasto the Jellyfish Chings. Making of Blasto the Jellyfish Chings. Old Yeller Centennial Remastered Edition. Asari Confession 26 True Blue. Okay. Military Correspondence. Dear Mr. Taylor, it was with great regret that I learned of your resignation from the Alliance military. In your many years of service, you have proven yourself as exemplary marine. You have been an invaluable asset to the Alliance military and we will miss you, your expertise and loyalty. It is for this reason that I am prepared to offer you a promotion to the rank of first lieutenant, along with the corresponding raise in pay grade. I would welcome you as an addition to my company. I hope that you will give my offer due consideration. I personally look forward to your response. And so do you call, on, call Colonel, I don't know how you say, Hashim Banks, 1st Third Division, Special Forces, Alliance Military. Did he accept? I'm wondering. Son, if you're reading this, I'm gone. With the inherent dangers of these missions, it seems foolish not to have some letter like this ready, so I'm sending this before we get too far from our last relay. I remember the look on your face when I left. You wanted to ask me not to go, but you didn't. You've grown to be a wise young man with a strong sense of duty. I wish I could take credit for that, but it has more to do with who you are than anything I taught you. The truth is, I haven't been around enough. And if you're reading this, then I'm never going to have a chance to fix that. My job is an important one, but a man can't hide behind the pressures of work. This was to be my last trip. Easy for me to say now, I know, but the money from the expedition would have let me settle down with you and your mother to carve out some kind of peaceful, quiet life far away from the pressure of space. Before I left, you were talking about joining the Alliance. I hope you find a kind of peace in camaraderie, camaraderie? <laughs> uh, with your team that I found on Gern's back. I love you, son. I'm proud of the man you've become. I wish I could have told you that one last time. Love, dad. I'm so surprised by this letter. I am very surprised by this letter. I gotta say. I did not expect. I thought he was a piece of shit through and through, but I guess he isn't. Not that I think it, it like, excuses all that happened, but... Still better than nothing, you know what I mean? I'm really surprised. Huh. Okay. Abnormal biotic powers with Jack. Archived combat footage compares favorably with Pragia, Pragia? I don't remember already. Facilities expected results. Easily manipulated through emotional impairment created by severe abuse and confinement during childhood. Terrible. Note, Subject Zero avoids the Normandy's extranet connection, works off a private omni tool line. She's smart. Search of Citadel, Newsnet Archive, search terms, Cerberus, Cerberus in Pragia, Pragia, Telton. Cerberus and Telton, Cerberus Doctors, Elusive Men, Miranda Lawson. Citadel Newsnet Archives, Galactic History, The Last Decade. Signed up at Citadel Newsnet Forum. What's that password? <laughs> Video of Get Attack on Eden Prime. Video of Get Attack on Citadel. Video of Commander Shepard's Spectre Inauguration. Close after 12 seconds. Video of the crash of the first Normandy. Interior footage. Video of Alliance Vessel Escape Pod Procedures. Twice. Mass Relay Location Map. Major Shuttle Ports on Citadel Worlds. Major Shuttle Ports in Terminus System. Travel Warnings. List of Citadel No Flight Zone. Banned from Citadel Newsnet Forums. Excessive and repeated swearing. Derogatory. Derogatory? 
comments, inflammatory comments, circumventing more safe filters. Sign up for Galactic Champion Poker. Okay. Played Galactic Champion Poker 15 minutes. Banned from Galactic Champion Poker altercation with other players, chat room moderators, see auto tr transcript. I need I need that. Use commercial VI program to wipe extranet history. So she has very good intention to survive whatever happens, is what I'm getting from this. Even if the ship crashes suddenly, she'll take a, a shuttle and go to the citadel or something, you know, and make a new life or something like that. Like, that's how, that's what I get from, from all this. I think it's that she's like, yeah, I'm not falling with you guys, like, I'll, I'll survive, thank you, <laughs> you know? Dear ja Jacqueline, oh, that's her name, that's why she's called Jack? Jacqueline. How do you say that in uh, in English? Jack Jacqueline, I guess? Not? Huh. Thank you for your submission to Galactic Poetry Monthly. We regret that we we're unable to use your submission at this time. Galactic Poetry Monthly generally focused, uh, focuses on mattered verse and you wish, you may wish to check our guidelines before submitting again. Oh, <laughs> what did you submit? <gasps> Text every submission. My soul burns with a fire of darkness quenched only in the pain of loneliness. I hold my breath waiting until spots appears appear black as the past and fill my lungs with lies of hope. I mark myself black and jagged to cover the scars, to make me a monster, a warning. This is not a place of honor. No esteemed dead or buried here. Why? Mattered verse? What does that mean? Like she didn't have the right amount of... Uh, of, of, like, syllables in a verse or something? Because that's a pretty good poem. I'm sorry. Tapped for possible Cerberus involvement. Dr. Caster, I'm so sorry these things. There's so much about prenatal element zero exposure that we don't understand. Unidentified woman. But no, no, she was fine. She was fine and happy. You just told me she needed a checkup. It happened quickly. We were unable to bring her back. You just said she needed a checkup. How did this happen? I'm very sorry. I want to see her. They literally kidnapped her. No, man, believe me. After what the seizures did to the poor child's body, you don't. How did this happen? We don't know. I'll be honest. This isn't the first infant we've lost this way. Why, God, why? We're working on treatments. The government doesn't put much effort into it, though. Don't want to interfere with their biotic recruitments. Sons of bitches. Those sons of bitches. Listen, this may not be the right time, but if you'd be willing to let us study your baby's body, we can do some tests. You want to keep her? I don't want another family to go through what you went through. I Okay, yes, whatever helps. Thank you so much, nurse. We'll have signed a few forms. I'm so sorry, ma'am. Open a secure channel. Authorization 3362. Yes, it's me. I've got a candidate. Highest potential I've seen in years. No, the family has been dealt with. Send team. She... She was literally kidnapped. They said she died and it was not true. And then they made her sign forms without knowing the full extent of the situation. Maybe her mother is still alive. Can we tell her about this? Oh my god, dude. Cerberus, I swear. Blue Suns founder, lost leadership of Suns through lack of interpersonal skills and political judgments. High mission success rate even after near death experience. Has completed several missions offered by agents. Involvement of the shadow broker these in these mission missions withheld. Hmm. Partial transcript of conversation recorded on Normandy's lower decks. Zaid. So this hotshot Turian moves in by the door, ignores my signal, and gets hit straight through the visor. Kelly. Oh my. It's like he was expecting slavers to hand out business cards instead of bullets. Was he alright? The Turian? Nah, Sniper took his head off clean. <laughs> his head clean off, I'm sorry. Oh dear. Right, it all went to shit after that. We jammed the radio equipment, but the slavers got a off a shuttle that came back with a bomb. But they were keeping people in that camp. 
Sure, they'd lose some credits, but there's always another civilian transport in the terminus system. So I'm beginning to realize, what did you do? Got the hell out. We killed their captain and the guards like we were hired. Figured the merc flying the shuttle wouldn't be dumb enough to blow up his own base once we left. What happened? The blood pack always did like them incredibly goddamn stupid. <laughs> okay, so they did. A personal note written by Masani to himself after being approached by Cerberus. He writes in a coding system that's popular among Terminus system mercs. This could be it. If this elusive man money goes through, through, it's time to get serious about buying a property. Got to narrow it down to a place I can stand for more than a year. Elysium? Only if the Alliance gets serious about taking out the Batarian in the Verge, so not in my lifetime. Ilium's an easy place for a man to disappear whatever, whether he wants to or not. Think I'll pass. Heard still too bloody crowded. Beckenstein? Stein? Decent weather, good food, mostly human. Good choice if I can stay under the radar. Eden Prime? Best garden world in the galaxy, but nothing's real but the farms. Hell, maybe I'll just buy a ship full of explosive and commit suicide by Omega. <laughs> Easiest retirement plan I've come up to with so far. <laughs> Zaid. We read Garrus. Asari Justicar. Rigidity of Justicar code makes her movement and mission outcome predictable. Mother to three are that Yakshi, one of which remains wanted for murder in Citadel space. Not anymore. I have called you. That's a transmission log. Samara, I have called you together to ask something of you. It is not a small thing, but it is for the best. Rila Faller? Are you receiving this? Quite well. Yes, mother. We're in common room, her communicator is too near the door. Try now, mother. This news will be the best delivered in person, but I am not allowed to travel before tomorrow. I have something I must do. It is Azardis, but the, and thus I must do it alone. F. What do you mean, Azardis? S. Tomorrow I take the oath of solitude. It is to prepare me for the other oaths, but it means F. You what? S. It is an oath required of all who... F. I know what it means, mother. I'm 42 years old. I have heard of just the cars. S. Then, do you understand why I must do it? F. No. S. The life of Justicar is dangerous. I will make enemies and they will seek to use you. F. That I understand. What is not clear is why do you... Why do this in the first place? It is not enough that we live a hundred light years away from you in a dank fortress. Uh, that we have no communicator of our own but must use this communal one. Do you know what it means to us to hear your voice? S. I'm sorry, Feller. F. And now you take that away. S. That is one thing, but it is the truth. I wish there were some other path. F. And you called us instead of coming to see us. S. If I come, if I came to see you, I would never leave. You know what that would mean. F. Is she that terrible, mother? Is she so of a menace that you would deny us ever seeing you, ever hearing your voice again? S. My dear, I cannot lose her on the world and pretend I owe her victims nothing. Her crimes are my crimes. In time you may see as I do. F. Time is a weak self for fresh wound. S. Please, do not let anger ruin this. We will have our lives to contemplate the pain and loss. Can we not see from one another's eyes just for a moment? F. Silence. S. Feller. F. I don't want to lose you, mother. No... Not over someone as small as Mirala, or whatever she calls herself now. Morant. And Ryla, you have been silent. Are you in accord? R. I can only say I will yearn for you too. Ashley, you have more than that. R. Is this the only way you will have any righteousness, mother? S. It will let me live a just life. R. Then the goddess forbid I take it from you. Wow. Radatir needs the call. F. She loves you, mother. She did not say it, but she does. S. And you. Can you understand why I must do this? F. Catch her. Just catch her. And now we did. So will she be able to talk to them again? I mean, she's still the Justicar, but like, at least she got... You know. She was able to catch her daughter and take care of that and... You know? Like... Maybe she can talk to them again. I really like the, um, what was it? Then the goddess forbid I take it from you. I really like that. 
that sentence. Possessions bequeathed by Justica Samara. Large goods. Four bedroom home on Tessia. Furniture and household appliances. Elka Sapphire Family Sky Car. Clothing and jewelry. Casual clothing. Approximately 20 outfits. Intimate negligees. Three. Dancing dresses. Four. Bond ceremony gown. Bond ceremony uh, bracelet. Hollow locket. Images of bond made children. Reprogrammable. Baby and children clothing. Various. Miscellaneous. Lifetime series fitness membership pass. First place trophy. Amateur Skyball League. Vida Novel Library, various. Photo albums, various. Sculpture of Samara and Bondmate. I haven't seen that sculpture, I don't think so. Personalized Happy Birthday Mom Travel Mug with photo of Samara and children. And oh, cracked and repair some glue marks visible. Memorial Sphere Bondmate's birthing crash. Oh, That's so cute. Tally, mechanic and engineer, typical quarian investment in species future instead of personal advancement. Father's work useful in widening tensions between Geth and quarian races. Huh. Suit process log. Upgraded interface GUI for relic technology. Free authorization. Project Haystrom. Upgraded suit diagnostic for radiation detection. Upgraded Omni 2 for enhanced data integrity. Upgraded translator software for all human languages. That's so cool. I, I never really stopped and thought about it, but like, obviously they all speak English when we play the game. But obviously nobody really speaks English except maybe Shepard. You know what I mean? And Joker. So they all have translators like live translators that are going on and now I'm just curious I want to hear you know I want to hear Tally speaking her language and Gareth speaking his language you know like that would be so cool I guess they can turn it off or is it like an implant I don't know but that's so interesting install suit application NutriScam 2.2 Install suit application engine master 3.6 human vessels. Installed suit application nurse Tim pro. Is that not um Maybe it's not. It, it isn't it the uh, the thing that the other Quarian was talking about to the Turian in Ilium in the bar. Kind of like a you know, uh, a feel good <laughs> uh, application, but maybe it's not this one. I don't remember what it was called. <laughs> Downloaded in Determined Vid, Exiles, Portrait of the Lost Quarians. Install prototype defense suit, Chill Jack. Huh. Upgraded medical scanning and quarantine suit. Sweet. Ran process infection treatment. Isolated. Downloaded education vid dealing with loss. Okay, so that was right after her... Um, her... Um, loyalty mission. Uninstall suit application Nervstim Pro. Reinstall suit application Nervstim Pro. Downloaded education vid understanding body language human edition. Huh. Downloaded interment vid fleet and flotilla! Uninstall suit application Nurse Tim Pro. Download education vid human courtship and mating. Tally. Install suit application Immuno Boost Professional Edition. Reinstall suit application Nurse Tim Pro Deluxe Edition. Can I can I fucking romance Tally? What is this? Or is she trying to understand? She she watched Fleet and Fl Flotilla, so is she trying to understand uh, our relationship with Garrus or something? Because there's a Tyrion in Fleet and Flotilla as well. Or is it? I have so many questions. I thought she was straight. I am so so confused. Email chain. Oh boy. 
Um, two Shadow Broker. Oh, okay, 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 okay. It's that kind of chain. From Tali, Zora, Nar, Raya. I know you don't know me. I'm the daughter of Admiral Rael Zora, and I've run into trouble on, on my pilgrimage. I was investigating a disabled geth and found a recording that seemed to indicate that a specter named Saren is working with the geth. He's betrayed the council and is working for some group called the Reapers. That's... that's... That's crazy. That's Mass Effect 1. I'm on the Citadel now, but Saren's people are after me. This is too big for me to deal with. I'm willing to offer you information in exchange for protection. Are you interested? That was before she met us, right? Before she met Shepard. I'm interested. You were smart to come to me. I have an enforcer on the Citadel named Fist. He can protect you. Give him the information and let him get you someplace safe. No deal. Saren has turned too many people against me. If we're doing this, I want to meet you in person. I can't trust anybody else. Understood. I'll meet you in person. Fist will set it up. I'm providing you the intel on a coin named Tally Zora. That was too fist. She wants a meeting and she's got valuable intel. Get her someplace safe, safe and avoid any intelligence channel. Spectre's Saren Atiris is after her. When you get the intel, kill the quarian and any of our operators who had access to the data. This information cannot be compromised. Top level security will be compensated for the loss of any of your people. Insane. Your agent was compromised. He tried to send me out to Saren. I've turned the information over to the human alliance commander named Shepard. And I think I've got all the protection I need. Thank you for your offer and I hope this does not affect any future exchanges. She has no idea. She's so naive. Of course, I apologize for Fizz's behavior. Should you ever change your mind, I'd be more than happy to offer my personal protection. Please contact me at your earliest convenience. Shadow Broker must have, must have gone crazy when that happened. He must have been like, fuck, you know? And then, oh, she doesn't know it's me. All right. And then, yeah, yeah, we can, yeah, yeah, we can do business again. Ugh, disgusting. But she had all the protection she needs. Hell yeah. Keystroke recording, Omni tool you, Citadel, begin new message. Dear Sen and he says Joran, I am Hiris Line. To the parents of Mir Joran, Hiris Line. My name is Tarizora Vas Nima, and I led a unit where your son was killed on Haystrom. Led a unit on Haystrom where your son died. Unit on Haystrom where Mir Joran died. I didn't know Mir Joran well, but he seemed like a good soldier and a brave young. Erase line. I didn't get a chance to know Mir very well, but erase line. I only served with Mir for a short time, but I was impressed by his bravery and his commitment to his people. Save progress. He died so that I could. He saved me at the sacrifice of his. He gave his life to get data that the Admiralty Board felt was. To get data that will one day bring us back to the own world. I don't know if that helps. Back to the own world, and we all honor his sacrifice. I regret erase line. I'm sorry for your erase line. I understand what you must be. Here is line. Save draft and exit. Oh my god. Yeah, that's tough. Oh, goodness. Let me drink a little bit before we continue. Kasumi. Skill break and enter. Specialist. Sentimental. Impulsive. Risk taker. Investigator. N investigate. Lover's death in connection to Alliance. Candle. Haiku. She does haikus. Breathless glint in skin, muscle working in rhythm, cloak desire watches. Looking at me now, his indifferent eyes smile. I am a poodle. What the hell? Beautiful and good, finishing with his canis. Jacob is perfect! No, you did not. You did not. Good for you. You two go ahead. I want no parts in it. Ew. <sighs> what? I am... I can't believe she wrote a haiku about Jacob. Ugh, you're a poodle? Oh lord. <sighs> two, Mati, two, Pillory, Blue Suns, Omega. I understand from my sources that you're looking to expand your collection of antiquities. They are the items I currently have in inventory. I was originally commissioned to obtain them, but when payment was not forthcoming, they became mine. Prices on all items are open to negotiation. In your case, I may prefer uh, favors over credits. Please use this same secure channel to respond. Inventory, Dome, Ceremonial, Head Tresbetarian. Da Vinci, Mona Lisa, Human. Are you kidding me that you have the Da Vinci, Mona Lisa with you? 
complete work of his team, poet Zisotal Vasranok. The Koainur Diamond. Koainur? I don't think I know that. Loose, human. Turian battle spike approximately 300 years old. Origin on no belief to be the one of, of Tuba missing its pair. Oh my goodness, she has so much money. Ready to go. What the hell? Thane, Drell Assassin, a chief top ranks in Henar training programs. Responsible for one hour massacre on Omega. Advanced Capral Syndrome makes neutralization a low priority. I wonder if other things appear when you do their um, loyalty mission, you know? Like tallies, there, there was stuff after, you know? I don't know. Preferred assassination methods. Human, rear approach, check shoulder to prevent turning. Hands to chin and base of skull, neck snap. Alternate, check and grab shoulder, arm around throat, Grip, jaw, single arm, neck snap. Wow. Asari, front approach. Throat punch to collapse hairway. Arm control lock to neutralize biotics. Advanced hip throw. Grip chin and scalp. Neck snap. Alternate. Warp fill on biotic barrier. Step pass. Kick to back of leg to collapse knee. Step in with knee to spine. Grip chin and scalp. Neck snap. How do you kill a Turian? That's, that really interests me because, oh my god. Must be difficult. Side approach. Low kick to knee. Grab arm and pull into broken leg lock as turn leg stiffens in pain response. Finger stab under jaw if unarmored. Unarmored. Or eye. Grab head fringe. Neck snap. Wow. Alternate. Front approach. Paired punches to vulnerable place just below eyes. Drop elbow to collarbone, front leg sweep while vaulting over, spinning. Next snap. G. I need I need an example in a video because it's hard to imagine. How do you kill a Krogan? Like I mean, hand to hand combat. That's insane. Top approach. Top approach. Okay. Double strike to eye ridge. Slide down between blinded target, raising arms. Precision nerve strike to throat. Secondary nerve strike to counter blood rage. Quad kick to bend target. Grip each side of skull. Running, leaping, spinning, neck snap. Alternate bomb! <laughs> I mean, fair enough. Like... <laughs> That's so good. Medical report. Dr. Chakwas. Okay, in the Normandy. I'm sorry. Lung capacity 42%. Left side lung shows large lesions. Right lung has nodular lesions only. 42. Antibiotic treatment. Low now resistant to cipoxidin, melanurin, and alburicin. Metastatic progress. Stomach, liver, minor heart. Heart. Negligible at this time. Okay, it's like a cancer kind of. Treatment options. Viable transplant candidate but refused to be added to list. Synthetic lung generation currently impossible for drill. Therapy and care. At this time, Mr. Cryo should continue getting regular cardiovascular exercise in order to stimulate lung movement and prevent or delay the stiffness that cause lack of oxygen transport. While physical stimulation may also be beneficial in keeping tissue flexible, any injury at this point will dramatically impact Mr. Krell's body and cause rapid degeneration. It is unclear how much longer Tain will be able to serve in direct action. Tain should continue to wear loose clothing that leaves his chest uncovered to prevent moisture buildup that would worsen the problem. The drill aid aidetic memory is often beneficial in allowing drill to escape unpleasant scenes by losing themselves at appear time. So it really is a drill thing. I thought it was maybe a Hainer, Hanner thing, but it, apparently not. In this case, however, Mr. Cryos, uh, Cryos, Cry I forgot, should try to restrict the time spent menacing as prolonged sedentary activity may increase the rate of lung de degradation. This suggests that what is best for Mr. Cryos currently is to continue to remain active and to engage with other team members in order to stay mentally and emotionally 
stimulated. So I need to take him out as much as I can with me on missions, I guess. Huh. Grunt! Okir's VAT bread prototype. Threat to continuation of genophage likely minimal, but leak knowledge and location of perfect Krogan to certain special task group. Recent external search sum summary. Search Krogan history, Grey Wars, genophage erased, Krogan victories. Okir erased, Grey generals, Tuchanka erased, Tuchanka. Er not, er not Rex, Battlemaster Shepard. Modified Commander Shepard. Modified Commander Shepard Normandy. Animal fights. Large predators. Tyrannosaurus Rex. Earth Lizard Rex. Dinosaurs. Amazing. More. Okay. Battle Master Human. He raised Earth Humans. Human History. Earth Wars. Uh, downloaded Human General Historical Conflict. Warrior. Humans downloaded. Documentary Footage Human general historical major military figures uh great human honored human awards great storyteller humans war stories human writers conflict human homer kipling hemingway <laughs> ernest hemingway audiobooks the sun also rises 14 percent completed for whom the bell tolls 100 percent completed a farewell to arms deleted the old man and the sea, 100% completed. Search sharks. Amazing. Makes so much sense with him. Sharks, dinosaurs, war stories. There we go. <laughs> catalog order. Ultra Black Ops Mega Catalog. Okay, those are transactions. Purchase case premium engine oil. Video download. The Madness of Sacrifice. Unauthorized biography of Warlord Okir. Economy box, fish dog food factory, tasty bites. When fauna attacks, attacks hot fish spice. Vania, a sorry confession, 26 true blue. <laughs> For an special spotlight, Krogan edition. Guard or Krogan battle master with real smash your enemies action is an action figures. Oh lord, he shouldn't have access to the extra net. That's not good. <laughs> Cerberus, rogue agency for advancement of humanity founded in 2157. Active in both citadel and terminus space, strong human supremacist overtones. Classified as a terrorist threat by both the system alliance and citadel council. The loss of credits due to elusive men direct interfe interference in recovery of Commander Shepard's body has been offset by data gathered from the Lazarus project. Withhold retaliation until Shepard's long-term functionality is confirmed one year post-resurrection. Activity highlights for a more extensive list of shell companies. See Cerberus economic structure. Manifesto published and then facility on Praga constructed in 2160. Subject zero born in 61. CDR holdings purchased Terra Nova Commonwealth Bank purchased. Infiltration of human media begins. Specializing in extrasolar news. Constant times got exam minor. Nascent Galactic Broadcasting Corporation. Project Doorway makes forgery of council standard Medicard and identity tags. Possible allowing agents on restricted mu movement. Scott destroys credibility of Vera Safin, front runner for Prime Minister of Systems Alliance. Leak to Galactic Broadcasting Corporation stopped by agents in place. Operative still anti matter from the SSV Geneva. Assignment goes wrong, but discipline holds and squad fights to the death. So survivor digital divulges little but names his sponsor Cerberus. Recruitment increases, the strange had started slow growth. Legitimate arms contract to colonial forces. Service agents among humans recruited into global maritime justice organized on Trident. Assassination of 22 Salarian Crime Syndicate's members on Trident leads to takeover of narcotic trade. Reprisals bloody but tolerable. Milky Way Foundation created to funeral money. Wow. Project Trapdoor. Terrible. A lot of uh, po poli political coup d'etat. 
I guess. <laughs> Trapdoor experiments on Asari captives with Omega and Camphalin to measure disruption of biotic powers. Estimate 2.5 milligrams active ingredients for each 25 kilograms of body weight. Under 7.5 milligram dose optimal to avoid detection by taste or smell. 3 to 5 citadel standard days on set period. Powers return in 2 to 5 sit stand days after last dose taken permanent damage possible. Nano surgery on subject zero successful. Omega encephalin fails to work on appropriate receptors. Program begins to install other service operatives with resistance to OE. Pope Clema 16 assassinated via rosary beads coated with sodium nonacetate that attributed to agent heart, heart failure. Wow. Replacement Pope Leo 14 uh, had eschatological beliefs in line with militarizing humanity, forgiving attitude to salarians. Recent genophage proves useful for strategic alliances against Turians. Wow. Disgusting, honestly. They're like Illuminati, basically. Cerberus. <laughs> basically, that's what it is. Ines Sim Simmons resigns as head of Terraforma Party. Frontrunner Claude Menno assassinated. Charles Serracino much more tractable. Tractable? Oh lord, they have their claws everywhere. Radium placed inside office chair of Systems Alliance Parliamentarian. Artyom Gavrikov. Gavrikov's death attributed to cancer. Emergency election. Much cheaper to manipulate than normal process. Service back candidate loses. Winning candidate approach found susceptible to bribes. Michael Moser Lang approached by operatives in militia community. Insider information given for stock buy to provide him with funding. Contact severed but electronical, electronic surveillance remains. Lang purchases armaments in flu of, in flux of humans into Trident political scene leads to renaming of capital with human name New Custo. Custo. Electronic surveillance removed from Lang's phone. Lang kills Enrique Aguilar and Ying Chong. Resulting approval bump for Vice President Belknap allows passage of financial reform bill allowing for increased loopholes, loopholes in colony-based shell companies. Fighting among Vice Premiers a bonus as Ligny alienates Polybureau Standing Committee and his chances of election to System Alliance Parliament are dashed. Insane! Successful acquisition of Light and Shadow Pictures Propriety Reality Plus Video Editing Machine. Capacity to forge photorealistic video is now unsurpassed. Matriarch Tilia Eraza targeted with Omega and Kefalin. Claims of biotic severity to non-biotics deflated once her powers fail. Voice in citizen legislature... Le legislature? Considerably diminished. Military arm creates posts on planet Bintu. MSV Anxiara sabotaged. Catalyst added to metastable metallic hydrogen fuel by timer injection. Ship breaks apart during FTL. All hands aboard lost during the Yarki Hawk. Rahirix Ursivis killed in the process. Explosion attributed to faulty engineering. And Mihal Kahoku begins investigation of suspected Cerberus activities. See competition details for more recent activity. I am disgusted, y'all. I mean, I knew, but reading it like this is, is, an, is a different story, you know what I mean? Elusive man. Profile. Cigarette smoke today, four. Uh-huh. Drinks consumed today, seven. Oh, he's even more an alcoholic than a... Uh... Then a smoker? <laughs> Daily Skyball score. 160 to 0. Fifth consecutive perfect game. Suit worn today. Julian Vaughn. Light line and blend. 2200 thread count. Single button closure. Bes Besom chest pocket. Five interior pockets. Four button cuffs. Side vents. Belt and protection for close range weapons fire. Plum. Sexual liaison past week. Where? 
Shani Shalani, Ilium Entertainment's sexual, sexiest human alive. Brooke Carrigar Skyball Champion, Vela Vicious, for an axe dream girl. 42185. Stacy and Sefi Strong, the Terra Firma twins. Matriarch Chalani, twice. Excuse me. I'm. At the same time, the twins? That's a no. Messages sent today to Citadel, Ilium, Omega, Earth, Horizon, Eden Prime, Tessia, Palavan, Tuchanka, Migrant Fleet. He's everywhere. I cannot. Captain Bailey. CSEC Captain, Survivor Reaper attack on Citadel. Prefers dealing with the Kira Ward's criminal element of the record. Ample blackmail material. Yeah, he is the one that we see when we arrive in the Citadel. Just after the security. Business correspondence. Listen up. <laughs> I'm sending this out because too many of our new recruits don't get that being part of CSEC on the Citadel isn't like security on a garden planet. I want you to drill the following into their heads until they're sick of your voice. Learn your district. Contacts don't make themselves. There is a mandatory minimum of 20 hours on foot patrol during your work week. No exceptions. Update your translators. The Citadel gets more than 9 million tourists a week. You need to understand whether that drunk from Omega is enjoying the nightlife or turning his buddies to flank you. True. Eyes are on us. Everyone from the council to your bus driver is watching the new CSEC. Yuck all you want in the locker room, but remind, remember, a mistake in uniform can get plastered over a whole damn galaxy's news network. That's it for now. Come to me with any problem cases you think you need to learn to lean on or boot out Bailey. I wonder how uh, Garrus would have done, uh, would have fared in such an environment for CSEC in the Citadel. Incoming correspondence list. Uh, summary of the previous day's council meeting, Citadel Newsnet, front page stories, sports, arts, entertainment. Email from ex-wife Reason, cancelled visit to the Citadel. VIP looters, dark side of the colonies. A report from Detective Nepatu Kasha on murder suspect Rose Jones. Department of Citadel Rapid Transport Emergency News built built time. <laughs> a recent cancellation of service from Zakira Ward to Tessary Ward. Request for backup for from Captain Keaton of Tessary Ward. An oath from Tessary Ward intendant. Sonal Beresh, expressing sorrow, reason, loss of Officer Lambart, and Bretness to gunmen on Tessary. Oh. Request for, uh, from Captain Kitim to temporarily transfer two CSEC officers from Citadel's Akira Ward to Tessary. Invitation from Captain, Captain Kitim to meet at, un unusual, at the usual place. O'Hira's Bar and Grill, level 16. Emma from Ex-wife, recent gang member, shoot out Bailey's health. She's concerned. We're almost done, guys. We're almost done. I'm sorry. It's just, it's so interesting. I can't, I can't stop reading. We've almost been reading for an hour. That's crazy. Okay, Aurea. <laughs> De facto leader of Omega. Three centuries of commando experience. Aloof, paranoid, excellent organizational and management skill. Recording taken on Omega. Door opens and closes. Enrix, ugh, what the? Aria, Kellis, Enrix, who the hell are. Hey! Don't bother, those shackles don't have release catch. You mistake me for one of your clients or something, lady? Let me out. Aria, this was very good. The Tyrion's been at Afterlife for a week. Usually I spot them earlier. Spot what? I know you're listening to the speaker hidden in Henrik's collar. I bet Henrix doesn't even know who he is really spying for, does he, Shadow Proker? Henrik, Shadow what? I don't know any- wait, where are you- what are you doing? You don't play favorites, broker. I admire that. But what I don't like is how you think. Anything twitches a muscle on Omega without me knowing it. My knowing it. Ah, oh, damn it, my face. Feel free to waste any- as many lives as you want, sending your agents down to my world. Okay, so I'm working for a guy, but it's not what you think. I'm not- door opens and closes, recording ends. Kelly Henrik's death has not yet compromised our other agent placed in the afterlight, Michael. Who? Who is the other agent? Is it, um... 
the the patriarch the krogan to Cherkis flynn from aria here's what i want set up for next month senior sisters they're good but i don't want them performing so close to the big burlesque act when it comes back from the mining colonies during out the flesh shows fight pit too many vorcha no one's going to see those little goblins no one's going to pay to see those little goblins eat each other when they do it on the street for free give me some krogans and enough humans to keep them busy for an hour that singer in tomorrow's men is from eclipse i'm surprised you didn't spot it bring him to me after last call Hanar jugglers before you send me the vid i thought you were joking book them i could use a laugh i want to see that we should consider making the casino ship a vip only event hand out passes to people who need killing and let them do it for me there were there was more blood than credits on the table after a shootout for last week jackpot what the hell so is that the dude Cher Cherkis flynn is the is the um the other agent what the fuck? Captain Anderson! Rejected Spectre candidate. Close working relationship with Commander Shepard before destruction of Normandy SR1. Monitor communications for renewed contact with Shepard. Sender, Captain Farrah Gapoli, Archer Station. David Anderson, I've been asked to step in on the matter of your continued vocal and insistent support of Commander Shepard, formerly of the OSR-1 Normandy, to the Alliance military to the third-party contracts. The matter of Commander Shepard and their involvement in the attack on the Citadel station is of high value to military intelligence and the Galactic Council. To that end, we respectfully ask you to cease and desist your continued investigation that has been deemed closed and sealed for two ye solar years. He knew she was not dead. Continued agitation in this matter is deemed a high security risk with potential repercussion for galactic security. Please consider our position carefully. If you have any questions, feel free to contact my office. Sincerely, Captain Farah Gapoli. Cynthia Barris, Atlanta Earth. David, Henry and I went to Jason's graduation ceremony in San Francisco today. Such a beautiful occasion. All those gowns and bright spirits, so much potential. I know Henry would frown at the thought, but I couldn't help recalling the pump around your ap apartment to the Hastings. You were the second in coming, weren't you? The military are always did ceremony very well. God, that was a lifetime ago. Jason says to send his best. I'm so proud of him, aerospace engineer. I don't pretend to understand what he does, but the gleam in his eyes when he's trying to explain his latest designs to me say that he has found his place in the universe. He wanted you to be there at his ceremony, but I know duty calls. He sees you as a heroic figure. Figure? Of fighting grand battles in space. It, I mean, it's true. I hope you can make it for the holidays this year. Henry asked just the other day, I know you don't see eye to eye on him on much, but he respects you. He respects what you do. And you know Jason is over the moon when you can take the time to review this ship, his ship design. Let me know about the holidays in David. David, please be careful of Cynthia. I hope he goes back. He has a family. That's so nice. Recent transaction. Catalog order Dionysus imports. Video download. Seren, a hero betrayed. What is Volley brand? Two bottles white wine. Damaged. The two behind the Citadel crisis. Ilium, Illid brand. One bottle gold label. Path of Lies, a history of alliance military. Afraid of the dark, reapers, collectors, and other myths. Yeah, he believes. Clean sweep home maintenance. Oh, I love Captain Anderson. He's amazing. Admiral Hackett! Commanding officer in the Alli Alliance Navy's 5th Fleet. Worked with Commander Shepard before destruction of Normandy SR-1. Deep cover operative in schedule to replace his current aid in two months. Major Caleb and Tella to Admiral Stephen Hackett. Subject, take an action on Commander Shepard's return, sir. We've confirmed sightings of Commander Shepard on Omega and that the Commander is now working for the terrorist organization Cerberus. Several Alliance officials have let it be known that they consider crucial that we interrogate humanity's first specter on our apparent desertion of Alliance in the Citadel. If we're being Shepard in now, we can gather an account on the Commander's past two years without being pressured by the galactic media to leak potentially sensitive data. In light of this, I am officially requesting that you rescind your orders against Alliance contact with Shepard. Rest assured, our department is dedicated to the Commander's safety. 
provided that Shepard is cooperative in furnishing us with detailed report of her previous whereabouts in current work for Cerberus. We anticipate releasing her from Alliance custody in the of five to seven months from acquisition. Respectfully awaiting your reply. Wow. What the hell? He clearly hasn't done it though, because we're still up and running. Major Antella, Department of Internal Naval Affairs. Oh, we have a response from uh, Admiral Stephen Hackett to Major. Major Antella, request denied! There we go. That's my Hackett. My real bro Hackett. I love him. He is so good to me. I'm so happy I have Captain Anderson and Hackett on my side as Shepard. Like, please. Of course, Shadow Broker is classified. What a surprise! Per your request. Oh, he looks amazing. We've landed on the Yag Ulm world and captured a specimen for your studies. We actually had to kill several of them before fighting this one, which seem interesting in leaving, interested in leaving the planet. Hopefully this means he's more tractable. I do recommend caution. However, these creatures may indeed be valuable shock troops or bodyguards, but their savagery puts even the Krogan to shame. As near as we can tell, it's part of their culture. They're not simple brutes like most Krogan. The one we've got is learning nearly as fast as a Salarian. He could be more dangerous than you realize. That, so that was the previous Shadow Broker that asked. And we're talking about the Shadow Broker we just killed. If you're reading this, my own friend, and you've eliminated the former operative Keshlu and have taken his position. These past few months, I've seen you learn and grow at a rate I would never have credited I had not seen to it personally. You already understand 17 languages without translator assistance. Wow. And your political prediction have bettered some of my best agents. As Ketchlu, you will command strike team to gather intelligence and neutralize potential threats. Remember your training. Losing your temper costs you to cost you that priceless mind of yours, as well as the loyalty of your men. The Shadow Worker leads those who look for secrets. He must be trusted by his men so that he can in turn trust them. Gathering knowledge is a holy task. One, I'm sure you understand, as you wanted to be off your own world so badly that you, what you want, to see what wonders await you out there. Please provide an update of all operations, Keshlu, and know that I'm proud of you. Wow. So maybe he actually took over, but because the previous shadow worker meant for that to happen. Remove operative Keshlu immediately. He is too dangerous to leave alive. Okay, I guess not then. <laughs> Engage only with numerical superiority. Um, otherwise, change all access codes and observe only. Provide no information. Keshlu mu must not be allowed any further access to messages. To all from Shadow Worker. Operative Keshlu is no longer a problem. Discontinue code changes and resume normal activity. I want a status report on all operations by the end of the next solar day. Shadow Broker out. And that was the YAG that took over that's so cool dude oh we have a codex now yaga a race of massive apex predators from the world of parnak whose rise to sentient in no way blunted their violent nature a group of yag is unable to cooperate until a single leader has been determined through either social maneuvering or brute force but no grudges are held once a yag establishes dominance former rivals serve their new superior purpose with unflinching loyalty and relentless determination, legacy of their origin as pack species. Their eight eyes are another sign of their hunter ancestry. All four pairs are geared toward tracking down and predicting their movements of prey. Sophisticated and keenly developed sensitivity to movement and light have made Yags master at reading body language regardless of species. Much to their short-lived chagrin, the Council's first contact team discovered it was nearly impossible to lie to the Yag. Wow. Technology equivalent to 20th century Earth standards, but they were discovered by the Council in 2125. Council ambassadors approached the Yag as friends and islands instead of subordinates, a baffling sign of contempt the newcomer from newcomers on Parnak. The Yag attacked when it became apparent that the alien diplomats turbulently considered themselves sovereign people instead of new underlings. Parnak remains off-limit by order of the Council, which fears that the Yag's size, aggression, and obsession with control makes them poorly suited for integration into the galactic community. That's... so dangerous. 
I'm I'm really hoping we hear more about them in the next um, the next game in Mass Effect 3. Holy! Uh, do I have upgrades? I think I bought everything last time, right? Everything I could, pretty sure. Wow, we read for an hour. That's insane. I did not uh, expect that at all. I I I uh, it passed so quickly. What the hell? Let me just go around. Ah, we just put some music. What does this console do? This is the video surveillance access point. I've queued up the archive footage you requested on your last visit, Shadow Broker. Aria Talok, Omega. Seems dejected. Music is good. David Anderson, set it out. That's Cerberus. Writer Gavon, Omega. Oh, she's trying to um <laughs> She's trying to interview her Krogan! <laughs> she just got punched! Holy shit! That's so good! That's so good! Twenty. What happened to that Krogan? Weird. Matriarch Atheta, Ilium. That's. Wait a damn minute. That's the bar made in eternity bar and she's looking at liara she in love with liara because liara's markings are pretty uh what the hell okay clan or not they just kill the salarian like that Goodness gracious. Elias Kellum, Omega. What the hell? Jacob Taylor, Normandy SR2. Why does Shadow Broker have a camera of in the Normandy? Of course, he's doing sit ups. I can only imagine Kasumi being like... <laughs> Subject Zero, 
Purgatory. Ship now defunct. Oh, that's a cool vid. She's too cool. Look at that jump, dude. That's insane. Aria to look. Omega. All right. Check for more videos on your next visit. I need to come back. Can I uh, switch? Shepard, glad you stopped by. We don't get many visitors. Take it easy. You've been through a lot. Yeah. You're probably right. I never did say thanks for the rescue. Liara never gave up on you, Farron. I just helped. Yeah. I'm still amazed Liara came for me. I'll never forget what either of you did. I can log that in the archives for you, sir. I see you met the secretary. For two years, Liara didn't stop looking for you. You two must have been close. She's a good friend. Better than I deserve. Are you holding up, Farron? I'm... I'll be alright. I wasn't always strapped into that interrogation chair. Drell can mentally escape into mm. old memories. I it like all his colors. Bad days. How many times did the Shadow Broker hook you up to that contraption? A lot. It gets fuzzy. He made the guards watch as an example. Jesus. What will you do now that you're a free man? I want to help Liara rebuild this place. But after that... Your schedule's getting full, sir. Let me sync it to your Omni tool. No thanks, I'm fine. <laughs> How did you and Liara both end up looking for my body? Cerberus headhunted me and Liara to steal your body from the Shadow Broker. I was working for the Broker at the time, and he's the one who scraped up your remains in the first place. Wow. What turned you against the Shadow Broker? He started working for the Collectors. You weren't their first victim. I am... was an information traitor. Not a slaver. Looks like you've made a friend. The drone follows everyone. I don't know why the broker kept it around. I'm a shell for a specialized data processing VI. Custom built to your specification, Shadow Broker. It helps coordinate the network's massive information feeds. But it could use a different interface to... <laughs> you deemed my default personality sufficient for your needs, Shadow Broker. I wish it would stop calling me that. How do you think Liara's doing as the new Shadow Broker? Operations are almost fully recovered after a slight dip in efficiency. Ever since we repaired the network, Liara's been glued to the archives. <laughs> I caught her sleeping at her desk more than once. I mean... She's busy, <laughs> but... I think she likes it that way. It's so funny because I haven't left, you know, when they say that, but like... Take it easy, Baron. <laughs> Thanks. I haven't left. We, we just arrived, you know. <laughs> it's fine. That's alien. That is definitely Alien. The Alien song. Of the Alien movies. <laughs> okay. Definitely reminiscent. That was so cool. I liked it. Mission report ready. Success. I'm a hacker to the fifth fleet. Have ambushed the colony raiding pirates. Ooh, credits. Failure. Certain foundation and antibiotic tests have been blocked by Citadel. Ah. Embedded correspondence. Okay, wait. Smear campaign. Mission report ready. Success. Petition retires for public service after your smear campaign. What? Udina? She says the police quietly slip you a cut from the raid 
of the red sand factory. Oh, that's not okay. That's not okay. Oh. Embedded correspondence. Citadel, New Citadel news agencies are trying to place more reporters in the terminus system. Use the resources to set up these journalists with safe houses and reliable contacts so they can bring back news from the... Uh, yeah, that's good. Sure thing. Okay. Um, blue listed. The blue suns are becoming dangerously powerful. Run a galaxy wide exposed under corruption, tendency to turn on their employers. It will send business to their competitors. Yes. Why not? Clashes between countries on the Batarian home world of Karshan are becoming frequent. Make sure no nation state gains more control than the others by regulating weapon sales to all sides. I don't like doing that, but money. <laughs> I miss money in this game, okay? Benary Helix is trying to develop hormone implants for Alliance soldiers that fall outside the Citadel generic treaty laws. The company is prepared to be very generous if you let them know when the Citadel inspectors are coming. No, I don't like that. The other one I shouldn't have either, but whatever. It's fine. Veteran State Arms has sent a s schematic for modifying the SMG in exchange for help in blackmailing Citadel officials. That's not good. I should have done that. But sure. <laughs> but it's it's submachine. Shepherd, I'm, I'm glad, glad you, came. you came. All right, let's go. I need to come back though. I need to come back. Uh, <laughs> and now Liara is, is supposed to come with me on the Normandy, I think. Right? Like, we're supposed to have a drink or something? Maybe not. Good lord. No new messages. Dude. Oh, we don't have that many credits anymore. We use too many of them. Hell yeah! Plus 60% so much. That's insane. That's insane, dude. Shepard, how can I help? Have you got a minute to talk? Later, better. Think I've cured Joker's condition. Simple treatment would... Anything else? I heard I'll that let before. We'll be here Let's do Thane. Uh, we're supposed to do Thane missions right now. On the Citadel. <laughs> we have a little bit of time, I guess. I. <laughs> ah. Dude. I don't have enough money, though. Now we have this new new place to explore to. Wait, where's the mass relay? Okay, here. Set it all. I need to read about the drills though. Hmm. We haven't even done a mission yet. Let me read about the drills first. Non-council? No. Drell biology. Is that all we have? Omnivorous reptile-like humanoids with an average lifespan of 85 galactic standard years, similar to humans then. They give life birth to their young or are capable of eating solid food from the moment they are born. Drell appearance is very similar to Asari and humans, but their muscle tissue is slightly denser than that of humans, giving them a wide restraint. Many of their more reptilian features are concealed, like a three-chamber heart with a muscular ridge that is capable of shunting oxygenated and deoxygenated blood as needed. Oh, that's cool! One unique characteristic, however, is the hyoid bone in their throats, which allows them to inflate their throats and produce vocal sounds outside of human range. Would-be assassins have noted that these features make Drell extremely hard to strangle or suffocate. Because the Drell ancestors emerge from a harried 
um, rocky deserts, the humid, ocean-covered Anor Rome world of Kaje proved tolerable only when the drill stayed inside a climate-controlled dome city. Due to this huge disparity in the two species' homeworld environments, the leading cause of death among drill on Kaje is the bacterial lung disease called Keprol syndrome. Within a generation of the drill's arrival on the planet, the disease has become resistant to Hanor antibiotics and other advanced treatments. Once an infection settles in, death is slow but imminent. Transmit may buy time, but as the infection spreads to other major organs, there comes a point of diminishing returns and eventual system failure. So it's not lung cancer. It is a bacteri bacteria. It's a bacterial problem. Wow. Okay. And it stops oxygen from like pairing with your hemoglobin, I guess. I'm I'm not sure. Like it, it stops your lung from um passing through oxygen to your bloodstream. Like something like that. Interesting. Very interesting, honestly. I want to know everything about this world. It's just, it's so interesting. Let's do his mission, because we haven't done a mission at all today. It's been an hour and 20 minutes. I cannot. This game, I'm so sorry, guys. This might be a long episode, but I mean, who minds, right? Not me. I can play forever. <laughs> and not mind. <laughs> oh, Lord. I can't wait to see how better my um, SMG is gonna be. Garrus, obviously. Uh-huh. We said also, the same thing. According to CSEC, a drill recently passed through customs. The CSEC office may have more information. Captain Bailey! Oh. You'd think Citadel security would be the tightest in the galaxy. I know CSEC too well to believe that's true. I see no fewer than 14 fatal flaws a skilled assassin could exploit. Eight of them existed when I was here ten years ago. That's crazy! Bailey, you know anything? Yes. My associate's trying to find his son. We think a local criminal may have hired him. That should be easy. We don't see many drell here. There we go. One of my men reported a drell recently. And he was talking to Mouse. Who's Mouse? Mouse? Ah, uh, petty criminal. Probably not the guy who hired your boy, but a messenger. He's a former duct rat. Runs errands for anyone who'll pay. Duct rat. What was it you called, Mouse? A duct rat. It's a local slang for the poor kids who grow up in the station. Oh. When they're small, they tend to play in the ventilation ducts where adults can't get to them. Oh, duct rat. Is that a problem? Aren't enough? the ducts dangerous? Every couple of months, we pull a little body out of them. Lacerated by fan blades, broken by a deadfall, suffocated by vacuum exposure. Jesus. Those are just the ones we know about. More just disappear. Maybe they get sucked into space. Maybe they fall into the protein vats the keepers run. The mouse survived long enough that he can't fit in the ducts anymore. He was one of the smarter ones, or the luckier ones. Jesus Christ. What sort of trouble has Mouse been getting himself into? Odd jobs for shifty people. Duct rats take whatever is available to get by. Data running, fencing stolen goods, selling illegal VI personalities. Actually, he was selling one of you. Me? Uh. Yeah, when you erased a file, it would say, I delete data like you on the way to real errors. That's pretty extreme, Commander. <laughs> Laugh it up, Gas. <laughs> Buggy, though, it crashed every half hour. The error <laughs> message was about how the galaxy was at stake and you should fix the problem yourself. <laughs> I cannot. I've heard enough. 
<laughs> Mouse is usually upstairs outside the Dark Star. <laughs> he works out of a public comm terminal. You should pick up a copy of the Shepherd VI when you talk yeah. to him. It sounds like your boy is running with the wrong crowd. Yes, I agree. If Mouse can't get you in touch with your son directly, he'll know who can. I'll help you if you need it. You don't know us, Captain. Why are you going so far to help us? I've worked Zakara for two years. Every day kids turn to crime because they've got no other choice. Because their parents don't care. Mm -hmm. You're trying to save yours. He faces a dark path. We better hurry then. You didn't tell him that Kolyat plans to assassinate someone. He's a cop. He tried to stop Kolyat and one of them could end up dead. I don't want that. Yes, right. of course. Thank you, Shepard. Fine, Mouse. I'm sorry, sir. Gee. <laughs> On the upper market level. Which is this side, right? Oh, yeah, completely. Completely destroyed. Okay, I need to buy stuff here. Shepherd, and this is my favorite store on the city. Oh my god! I have these two. I'm gonna improve sniper rifle damage. But I don't have enough money to buy this, which is 50,000. Maybe at the end of this mission, but I don't think so. Oh? Yeah, yeah, I can get that. No problem. Well, okay, that might be more difficult. No, that's fine. I got some quarry who can strip the copy protection. Just cost more. Yeah, I got the package. It'll be there, don't worry. I'll deliver it myself. That won't happen. You can count on me. Yeah. Uh-huh. Oh, yeah, no, I understand. Yeah, mm-hmm. You won't be disappointed. Well, I just need a bit more time. It's not my fault. Nobody told me the package was in two parts. Yeah, I know. I'll get it, don't worry. End of day, no later. You can count on it. I... I understand. That, that won't be necessary. I'll throw in a copy of the Shepherd VI. Hey, the Volus worked real hard on that. Yeah, sure. I can get you two cases by the end of the day. You mouse? What are you... Oh, shit. Krios. I thought you retired. Commander Shepard? I, I thought you died. <laughs> what do you want with me? <laughs> Be still, Mouse. You can change your pants in a moment. How do you know Thane? Krios? He didn't... If he didn't say nothing, I ain't either. When we heard the name, I didn't think it could be the same Mouse. He was a contact on the Citadel when I was active. He and some other children would gather information on my targets. You put children in danger to spy for you? Children, the poor. My people's word for their kind is Dralafa, the ignored. They're everywhere, see everything. Yet they are never seen. I'm a bit disgusted, but I you get it. You gave another Drell instructions for an assassination. Who's the target? I, I don't know. I didn't <laughs> ask. Because the people I work for... I don't need... They can make me disappear. I'd like to help you, Krios. You always I didn't done feel the renegade right now. I ain't gonna die for you. Yeah, yeah, I'm glad I didn't. Look, you know Thane. He wouldn't ask if it wasn't important. Do it for him. I want to. He was always nice to us. But these people ain't nice, Krios. Nobody's gonna know you talk to us. Mouse, I swear that you won't be named. All right, all right. He came with that hollow you took of me. Said he wanted a job. I ran through your old contacts to see who might give him a shot. The guy who offered was Elias Kellum. Those shepherd. One other thing, that shepherd VI you're selling. Oh shit! You hurt. Look, you were dead. It was totally legal to make a VI of you. I want one. Give me a copy, and we'll call it even. What? I mean, sure. Yeah, absolutely. Sorry about the whole. I could have so you know, done. I want a cut all the time. 
I could have been like, I want to Tell me go. about Callum. That's Human. so good. Moved to the Citadel about 10 years ago. He was little people when you were here, Krios. He got big after the Geth attack. Lots of the big guys from before got cacked, all in the big fancy apartments up on the Presidium. Now he runs the rackets on the lower end of the ward. Shen Akiba. He's seriously bad news. You just saved yourself a world of pain, kid. Yeah, right. When Kellen finds out what I've done, I won't live long. And I can't do anything about it but hide. Krios, you got any kindness for me? Put a bullet in Kellen before you go. That couldn't have been easy. Mouse knew more about my life than Kolyat ever did. He smiles up at me, broken teeth and scabby knees. Bare feet black. A dead-end future looking up at me, worshipping the petty gifts I offer. I don't like those, um... I was the only good thing flashbacks. he had back then. It's so weird. But I left him. It creeps me out. Cole yet. It's cool, but it's a little, little... Mouse said you had a hollow of him. Yes. A foolish bit of sentimentality. I can perfectly recall every moment I spent with Mouse. He pulls at my arm, smiles. He wants to know that I'll remember him, that anyone will remember him. I take the hollow. He smiles at himself in miniature on my palm. Then a frown crinkles his brow. He pats my pockets, checking for other hollows. Where's your son, Krios? He asks. Knock off the mopey crap, Jesus. Don't blame yourself. If I don't, who will? We must carry the weight of our decisions, Shepard. You, of all people, know this. Let's head back to Bailey. All right. I wish they still made role-playing games like they used to. These days, it's all big choices and visceral combat. I miss those old games where you had to remember to drink water, and it took five hours to feel time to Biomedical firm Serta Foundation is reporting a medical breakthrough against a new strain of interspecies influenza. The development comes as a result of samples contaminated during a biotic attack on their research center two years ago. Fortunately, there were few casualties. Mm. I can talk to them again. I think there's any place on board we could buy a fish. They don't like live animals on the Citadel. <laughs> Wasted life support capacity. <laughs> oh my god. Wait, wait. Here. Yes? Can we talk about my associate's son? You talked to Mouse? Did you get the name of the guy he's working with? Elias Kellum. Kellum? Shit. Uh, look, this is awkward. Kellum and I have a, an agreement. So? He doesn't cause too much trouble and buys tickets to the CSEC charity ball from me. In return, I ignore him. He bribes you. He pays you off. You were eager to help us before. What about now? Is it too inconvenient? I said I'd help. It's just there'll be repercussions if I don't handle it right. He and I give each other space. It keeps the peace. I'll get some of my people to bring him in and set him up in a private room. You can interrogate him yourself. I'll stay out of sight. And if I'm lucky, Kellum will believe that I had nothing to do with it. Bring him in. We might not have much time. I'll make it happen. Wait here. Okay, easy. We got Callum. Tell Bailey we're ready. He'll expect me to get him out of this. Not today, I think. Captain, his lawyer's here. Ben Elias has his VI set to page him if C sec gets within 10 meters. I'll stall him. Get oh. in there and work fast. I thought it, w it was easier than that. We should question him together. Keep the pressure on. Thoughts on how we approach it? Um, 
You be bad cop. Convince him that we'll put a bullet in his head if he doesn't talk. Once he's scared, he'll cooperate. Very well. I'll pretend we're ready to kill him. We can't push too hard, though. We need the information more than we need a corpse. I want to be good, good cop and him bad cop. Get me out of these restraints, Bailey. Pretty funny bringing me down here like this. The hell are you two? Oh. Bailey has nothing to do with this. Maybe I should we have done a few good cup. Off the record. Shit. Off the record in a C-sec interrogation room? Sure. You hired an assassin. Who do you want dead? I want to see my advocate. You apparently haven't noticed we're not C-sec. No deals, no due process, no advocate. And that's supposed to scare me. You two are in way over your heads. Bailey won't let you touch me. <sighs> Bailey doesn't know you're here. But he will. After we're done. You're not the only one who can buy off CSEC, Callum. What are you, frog boy? Hard little apologist? What, kid? Frog you gonna bore me into confessing? You ain't shit. Come on, hit me. I dare you. No, huh? Didn't think you had the balls. Think carefully, Elias. I want to catch the assassin, not you. Why stick your neck out for him? You want me to confess to putting a contract on someone? You think I'm stupid? I get the name, I walk out. You never see me again. I got no reason to believe you. Elias, if we were after you, we'd have already put a bullet in your head. We're running out of time. Bailey can't stall his advocate for long. Are we done here? Because I got people to see. Goddamn waste of my time. Right, we're not getting anywhere. Let's kill him and move on. Give me your pistol. What? Wait. I said get out of my way, Bailey. You have no right to- Oh, shit. What the hell is going on in here? Step away from my client. Is that- Do you have him tied to the chair? Glad you can make it, Freddy. Traffic was bad. Fuck. I feel like I, sh I should have chosen good- I thought it would be like- You'll need a shovel the size of the Citadel to dig yourself <laughs> out of this. This is all above board. I'm a council specter. Shit. What? What's that mean, Freddy? Specters can do whatever they want, Elias. I can't help you. Shit. If it was you I wanted, I could kill you and go. I want the assassin. Tell me who the target is and I'll leave. Damn it. Oh, okay. Joram Talid. He's a Turian, running for intended of Zakiro Ward. Where can we find him? I thought we were failing. His apartment's in the 800 blocks. Let's go. Oh. Okay. That was easy. I thought maybe I should have taken good cop and I would have more charm options. I thought it was like, who's gonna play the good and What's bad the cop? Story? I thought Why that was Kellum it. Why hired the boy? Assassination. A Turian named Joram Talid. You know him? Joram? Yeah. You might have seen his posters around. He's promising to end organized crime on the ward. Thing is, his message is all mixed up in race politics. He's anti-human. Are things so bad that people can openly campaign as anti-human? Before the Battle of the Citadel, the alien population thought we were violent upstarts. Look what's happened since then. A human fleet guarding the station for months? C-Sec filled with humans? Anderson does what he can, but some people have lived on the station since before humans had starships. They see it as a coup. If a majority votes for him, like it or not, that's how the system works. That's a nice ideal, Shepard. Sergeant, get a patrol car. These two need to get to the 800 blocks. Yes, sir. I'm sorry, that was weird. Like, I should have maybe used some inter... But I didn't want to kill him necessarily, but I guess I would have just intimate... intimidate him. There he is. How do you want to play this? I should this? have chosen good cop. Follow the lead on the maintenance the catwalks. Tell me maybe. what he's doing. 
The Krogan bodyguard will make him easy to follow. It still worked. Where will you be? The darkest corner with the best view. Brian. I'm on Kira, Lord of Hunters. Grant that my hands be steady, my aim be true, and my feet swift. And should the worst come to pass, grant me forgiveness. Wow. Okay. He's stealthy. There's a keeper. It's been wonderful talking with you all. I hope you'll come out on election day. You can count on it. Show the humans they won't get their way. Ha. Thanks. Just remember, it's not all about the humans. They couldn't have gained this much power without the council's support. Taking back our ward is only the first step. We must remove the cowards and appeasers on the council. This doesn't stop here. I'm on him, Thane. He's talking to some voters. Understood. You're in position? Yes. It's been wonderful talking with you all. I hope you'll come out on election day. I'm following. Okay. Stay close, Shepard. What do I do? Oh. Uh, I'm sorry, I... yeah. <laughs> Looks like he's talking to another voter. Any sign of call yet? No. I'm moving to another position. Ahead of him. It's been wonderful talking with you all. I hope you'll come out on election day. Okay. Did that work? Target in sight. Oh. Can you give me an update? Wait a damn minute. What's he doing? Wait, what the fuck? Wait. Where? Shepard, what's his status? I mean, I'm trying right now, but uh... What the fuck? I don't understand. Where did he go? I don't think we can pick up this trail again. I'm heading to Delete's apartment. Meet me there. Fuck. I... Huh? I don't... He went on the right, but like, what could I have done? Is there is there a glitch? I don't Huh? <laughs> I think my mission glitch, guys. Uh we're gonna load. Like I don't understand what just happened. Entropy wins. Entropy always wins. Huh? I uh, no no we're gonna load that I I think my uh, my whole mission glitched I I don't accept that type of uh when was that that should work what the hell just happened I huh <laughs> it's been wonderful talking with you all. I hope you'll come out let's try this day. again count on it. show the humans they won't I'm on him, Thane. He's talking to some voters. Hey, I don't understand what just happened. Do you have the target? I've got him. There we go. Okay, now we said something, at least. And now are they, are they gonna go there? Okay. That's fine. Can you give me an update? I'm almost in position. He's letting the bodyguard do all the work. That lets him deny involvement. Did he do that last time? I thought they went there. Target in sight. Hmm. 
Maybe I didn't... Maybe it was the same thing, but I thought they were going there. I don't know. <laughs> it was very confusing. <laughs> Oh, going this way. I see him. This is so cool. What's he doing? I don't have a good angle. What's he doing? One of his guards is talking to the bartender. Looks like a shakedown. I'm relocating to the no problem so far. Bag. A couple of mercenaries. Mm. Looks like the same group his bodyguard comes from. Mm. He looks nervous. Could be he's noticed you. Maybe he saw Kolyad in here somewhere. Also a possibility. There are obstructions ahead. I'll try to go around. Don't lose him. You're running for office. Lots of people watch you. Yes, sir. This mission is so glitchy. What the? doing back here I'm with the Citadel Health and Safety we've had vermin reports in storage areas around here what you can't be serious how did you get in here if I didn't have authorization how did I get in you see any other doors there's the keeper never mind just just go on through okay Thanks. thank you yeah yeah just don't let my boss see you okay oh And that's that's Thane's son, or ah! call yet? Okay. Uh, at least we've seen them I now. Saw. He's heading to Talid's apartment. Okay, that's better. <laughs> I'm so lost. Call yet. This, this is a joke. Now, now you show up. Help me, Drell. I'll do whatever you want. C-Sec. Put the gun down, son. Get out of my way. I'm walking out. He's coming with me. They'll have snipers outside. I don't need your What the hell? Talid, get the hell out of here. Yeah, yeah, I will. That was a Paragon interrupt? Holy Take shit. Take the boy into custody. You son of a bitch! Your father doesn't have much time left, Koliat. He's trying to make up for his mistakes. What? So you came to get my forgiveness? So you could die in peace or something? I came to grant you peace. You're angry because I wasn't there when your mother died. You weren't there when she was alive. Why should you be there when she died? Maybe we should go back to the Normandy together and talk there. They killed her to get to me. Wow. It was my fault. What? After her body was given to the Deep. I went to find them. The trigger men, the ringleaders. I hurt them, eventually killed them. When I went back to see you, you were older. I should have stayed with you. I guess it's too bad for me you waited so long, huh? Kolyat, I've taken many bad things out of the world. You're the only good thing I ever added to it. That's nice. 
This isn't a conversation you should right? have in front of strangers. Right. Boys, Thank take you. Coliat and his father back to the precinct. Right. Give them a room and as much time as they need. I'm surprised you're letting him do that. You think he's the only man who ever screwed up raising a son? I have to get back to the precinct. Come on, I'll give you a lift. We just read about her ex, you know, being like um, cats in a cradle. Okay, I like this better, guys. Like, first time around, that was not right. I don't know what happened there. <laughs> Completely failed. <laughs> Glitched, possibly, I don't know. But uh, that's better. That's better. There we go. Okay. I've been in there a while. Uh, the kid's been through a lot. I ran some searches in the CSAC archive. About ten years back, a bunch of real bad people were killed. Like someone was cleaning house. The prime suspect was a drill. We never caught him. Ten years is a long time. Whoever was responsible for that probably doesn't exist anymore. Yeah, I guess you're right about that. Hmm. The way he walks. How'd it go? Our problems are... They aren't something I can fix with a few words. Mm. We'll keep talking, see what happens. Your boy shot some people. No one I feel sympathy for, but there it is. I watched those guys shaking down businesses and threatening humans. But he can't just get away with it. The kid wants to make a difference. Give him community service. Community service for attempted murder? What jury would agree to that? None that I've seen. This would need to stay out of the judiciary. Strictly within CSEC. Mm -hmm. Interesting. I'll think about it. Thank you, Captain. Nice. Okay. I... Can't I go? Like... Yes? I should be going. You need anything else? Let me know. Access denied. Would have been cool. Alright, so we got Thane's loyalty now? I'm guessing. I want to know when the next shuttle will get here. There's one every 10 minutes. That was uh, that was weird. I don't understand what happened uh, the first time around. But anyway, we worked it out. It's just I. It was strange. We only have one loyalty mission left. That's crazy. That's insane. Headshot plus fifty percent. Plus forty percent heavy pistol damage. Crazy. War ammo. Better. Breathe. Energy drain. That could be cool. I've never tried that. Reef sounds pretty good though. That's also pretty cool. I want to try energy drain. Okay. I don't know if I have the points for... yeah. I wonder if I can... 
change back my... I have a lot of element zero now. Maybe I could try to... Yeah. Let's see. Yeah, we're full. We are full from full, dude. So, power damage is better, but I don't have uh, much health. But power damage is better, so... I mean... Attack... And... Heavy or... Uh, shield and synthetic damage is better though. Heavy. Incinerate. Heavy. There we go. More damage. <laughs> Let's go talk to Thane. Um, before we finish this. And next episode we'll do Project Firewalker. I think that's the plan. We also still have a lot of um, N7 to do. I haven't done Citadel Fort ID. I don't know about that. And now I don't have a lot of credits anymore. I should probably do the N7 before doing grunts. Stuff. Do you need something? Have a few minutes to talk? Certainly. If you don't mind my saying, you don't really seem like an assassin. You've spent too much time fighting thugs who think custom-painted armor makes them professionals. Mm -hmm. The Hanar trained my body for this role since I was six years old. Jesus. The Hanar? Excessively polite, worshipped Protheans? <sighs> they don't seem the type who train assassins. Every species trains assassins. The Hanar are only unusual in that they need other species to do the killing for them. They have a strong grip and natural toxins, but... Have you ever seen one move quickly outside of water? Or fire a gun? Right. You've been killing since you were six? Of course not. I didn't make my first kill until Still. I was Still! They were training me. I was not to be used and thrown away. I was an investment. You were a child, not an investment. I've given you the wrong idea. They valued me, yes, as a resource, but also as a person. They regretted their need for me. Why did your parents agree to this? The agreement was made under the compact. It was an honor for our family. The compact? We live on the Hanar homeworld because they rescued us, some of us, from extinction. We owe them our lives. That is the compact. Sounds, uh... Um, what exactly are the terms of the compact? There are many things problematic. the can't do, even with mechanical aid. They ask Drell to assist them. Sounds like slavery to me. This can't be legal. They made your whole race into slaves. Don't insult me, Shepard. Anyone can refuse to serve. Few do. We owe our existence to the Hanar. We are proud to repay the debt. The way you describe it, the Hanar sound like weaklings. Ah. Out here they are. I'm so insulting. But if you could see them in the encompassing, the oceans of Kaje, you would see them differently. The stream of silver in the dark, looping, diving. So fast the eye can't follow. Laughter like the squeals of a child vibrates the water. They fly over the black of the seabed like birds, plumed with the light of heaven. Why was your race going extinct? Overpopulation. That must sound trite to you. Humans developed mass effect drive before the problem became acute. Our homeworld, Rakana, had few resources. We hadn't even developed fusion power when the soil began to fail from overuse and pollution. The Hanar found us a century ago. They sent hundreds of ships, evacuated thousands of us. Billions more had to be left behind. 
So I guess it's like a working partnership, kind of, the compact. But to, to until when, you know? Like, when until when do you have to repay the Hanar, though? Like, What's the state of Rakana now? Do you read your philosophers? A man named Thomas Hobbes. When all the world is overcharged with inhabitants, and the last remedy of all is war, which provideth for every man by victory or death. How does he As know? Rakana died around them, my people slaughtered each other for mouthfuls of water, crumbs of food. But you don't kill for the Hanar anymore. You're freelance. What changed? I was asleep for a long time, yes. I paid no attention to what my body was asked to do, but then... Laser dot trembles on the skull. One finger twitch. He dies. Then, the smell of spice on the spring wind. Sunset colored Oh, he met his wife. I'm, I'm guessing. Dances away. I'm guessing that's why he... My apologies. He... Slip into memory so easily. He uh, suddenly had a family and he was like, Yeah, I don't want to do this anymore. Was that one of your assassinations? Uh, yes. Perhaps we can discuss it later. I've wasted too much of your time. Do you need something? Have a few minutes to talk? Later. I'd like to consider what we've already discussed. You mind if I ask you a few Not questions? Not at all. The Drell live on the Hanar homeworld, don't they? Yes. I know many think the Hanar are difficult to understand. It's just that they're very formal with those they don't know. We know them quite well. If you ever get close enough to a Hanar that they tell you their yeah. soul name, you would find them I more. should go. I shall return to my meditations. Hmm. Hey, got a minute? I'm glad to hear Thane and his son are back in touch. It'll be hard, but I think they'll be fine. Joker and Edie are like an old married couple. Yeah, they are. I keep expecting to walk in on them bickering about the temperature in the cockpit. Edie has a wicked sense of humor. Or I should say, a really funny lack of one. Sometimes she seems like a person. Mm. But when it comes down to it, I can't get past her being a computer. Come back later. I'm sure I'll have more to talk about. Does Garrus have anything to say? I'm sure he doesn't. But I mean... Shepard, need me for something? Have you got a minute? Definitely, but I want to try it with you. I want a few moments that are just for us. I want that too, Garrus. Okay, that sounded bad. Oh, hell yeah. <laughs> Always somewhere close. <laughs> I love that sound. That sound is so cool. Look at him. Doing his calibrations. All day, every day. That looks so cool from up close. What the hell? Wait. Is that the visor? Yeah, it is. His eyes are so fucking cool. Look at that. Good lord. <laughs> I have the uh, Drell Codex. I guess, yeah. Culture. Alright, uh, we're gonna stop here. Yeah, I think next episode. Next episode, we can. I'm gonna say there. Do some N7. Or I guess Project Firewalker. We'll do Pro Project Firewalker. It'll probably give us credits. And then. The episode after, I'm guessing it's gonna take a full episode to do that. We could do N7 before going to Grunt um, loyalty mission. So we have like max credits to buy stuff on 
to Chanka because there's a lot of stuff we can buy there, but it's so expensive. So I'm gonna need to choose. I'm not gonna be able to buy everything. I think we still have like biotic and shit that we can buy there. Uh, probably some weapon damage or yeah. So that was super interesting. I really liked reading all the stuff at uh, the lair of the Shadow Broker and Thane's mission was cool too. I didn't check um, his outfit. Let me check his outfit, his new, new one that we get with the loyalty. Because I'm guessing he's loyal now. Hell yeah. Oh, that's cool. It's kind of like white a little. I don't hate it. He, he has shredder ammo. Okay, I see. Yeah, we're only missing a uh, grunt. His face changes too when I add the uh, like the others. It doesn't change, but he does. Love it. Maybe she could accompany Zayed in the red. So that everybody fits together. <laughs> nice. Yeah, Project Firewalker shall be next. Next uh, episode. Next thing that we're gonna do. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed today's episode. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye!